Hi, I'm Ian Fidance, and I'm here to answer the internet. Would you rather lose a leg or never be able to have sex again? I'll tell you, I walked around with a cane and it fucking ruled, dude. <laughs> Take the leg, all right? Dude, people are like, where's this? I'm like, over you under, you know? Dude, you take Did the cane, hit like, someone in the chest, yeah, you know? Yeah, you like speaking to me, pal? Ripper snapper? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You say something, you put a point on it with a stamp of the cane. I want to get a wooden cane with a skull and a knife in it, you know? If you could be the patron saint of something, what would it be? Eating ass. <laughs> the, I feel like you were, you were early on the eating ass train. I was. Awesome. If I bought stock in eating ass, I'd be a millionaire right now. <laughs> that and trans women. Um, <laughs> I'm OG trans women. It's like that is, 2006. Had before, man. The first time that you watch some porn like that and you're like, this is kind of like, you know, better. Everything you've ever wanted. Yeah. Yeah. The best of, like a Miley Cyrus song, the best of both worlds. <laughs> is actually, I would be the patron saint of um, kindness, love, and compassion. Oh, oh boo! Fucking loser. That's right. Now, if you're a, f if you're a freak, leave me alone. <laughs> is sex with conjoined twins a threesome? Yes, dude, it's two freaks and you. <laughs> like, I mean, what you're already getting brain? freaky. What if it's one, like one, is that? Is that what if it's one brain? Then you're committing a crime because you're having sex with a clearly mentally handicapped person. <laughs> no, that means but, someone's got half a brain that you're banging. Yeah. It's like banging a poodle. What if it's one set of genitalia? That's what I meant. And two heads? Yeah. Oh, whoa. I didn't think of that. Yeah. Okay. It's, if you're getting domed from two of the heads, that's a threesome. And if you're just banging the puss with two bodies attached to it, then that is fucking a chick while her sister watches in the room. <laughs> yeah. What if you fell and you'll probably get a show on TLZ. What if, exactly. <laughs> what if you fell in love with one half of a, side, a conjoined twin? Like what would you do? Like what? And the other. I mean, this is you. this isn't Coney Island. I'm not a, on a freak show. There's no way that's happening. Are you swiping right on conjoined twins what on Twitter? If, what if? You, if I see one eyelash longer than if, the other, it's left. Okay, you're on. You're on, <laughs> you're on stage, right? You look out in the crowd. You see the most beautiful girl you've ever seen in your life. You tell the manager, leave my, leave her my shit. Little did you know that like that girl sitting at the table with her was connected to her. So yeah. now you know that this is the most beautiful girl you, you have. And the seen. manager gives her my number. Yeah, and then she calls I, her, like, let's meet up. And then she shows up and she's a good I like, treat it like a Travis Scott concert. I push my way to the front and I yank the number away from her. All right? That's what's happening. I'm stampeding through to make sure those freak shows never contact me. All right. <laughs> Eve Vidan, say all you freaks, stay out of my DMs. I'm in love with a gal. And we have cats. Who's the freak now? Uh, if you could be homeless in any city, where would you choose? Well, I guess if I could be homeless in any city, it would be uh, Paradise City by Guns N' Roses. Thank you. Dude, you definitely want to do a beach town. Yeah, yeah. That it's would be sick. A, That's why Santa Monica is such a nightmare, dude. Everyone's like, I could just be homeless in a tent, do drugs, and surf? Hell yeah, dude. And you just do heroin and that keeps you warm at night? It's the best scenario. Is eating in bed gross? Whoa. Uh, all depends what you're eating, and all depends if you have like a tray or something no. for crumbs to fall on. If you're eating cookies in bed, you're a piece of shit. All right? Oh, yeah, Bro, I'll eat fucking, I eat crackers in bed. What? I, yeah, I'll, I'll eat You crazy. animal! You complete Bull. animal! I'll, 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 dude, when I go to bed at night, I'll probably take with me a bowl of cereal, peanut butter and jelly sandwich, and some cheese puffs, and then a bunch of candy. Are you Stuart Little? What the fuck is the matter with you, dude? I picture you doing that in a full pajama bodysuit with a nightcap and a candle 
lit, like going to fucking bed with all your little nighttime snacks. <laughs> the crumbs in your bed must be out of control. Oh, it's, uh, it's insane. Do you vacuum? How do you get? How do you get them out? I honestly don't. No, he just thought about crumbs. it, so he just asked. He just sleeps on the crumbs. Bro. I mean, I'll like. I'll, can I'll I get you a Dyson? Feet. How often do you wash your sheets? No, uh, not often enough for that. I have not once a month max. When, when did I when did I fall asleep on that Reese's bar? <laughs> <laughs> That was just, that was not a joke, that was a genuine fucking... Most times that was a marker of time for you! That's incredible, that dude! That was one of the things you ever said, and you did not say that with a hint of a joke. No. Hey, back me up on this, man. When was uh, the last time I fell asleep in my human filth? Remember when I came in here with a rich cracker up my ass? When was that? Oh, shit, man, I forget. He had a cum stain on his pants, on the outside of his pants, at work. It was what? Like, it was like sweatpants that I had like jerked off in, and then like, I guess like... It wasn't a full load, it was like bad. It was enough. <laughs> Dude, the key word there is load. I don't care if it's a quarter full or half a tank. You still got cum on your clothes, bro. What the fuck? I will not judge though, because uh, one time I showed up to a wedding with a cum stain on the back of my suit. <laughs> on the back? Yeah. Catching back. Well, yeah, yeah, because because I pulled out and was like, Meh! and uh, it looks like when I come, I go get Zooks. So I gave her the old get Zooks, and I guess it like landed on my like oh, suit yeah. on the ground. Oh shit! Yeah, it wasn't like I did a trick shot. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, babe, you wanna see something? <laughs> <laughs> I'm my own grandpa and I'm coming on my own back. Would you punch your grandma in the face to fuck the girl of your dreams? Guess what? Already fucked the girl of my dreams and old Grammy's dead. <laughs> Dig her up! If you could die and come back as any inanimate object, what would it be? Uh, probably Cindy Crawford's bicycle seat. <laughs> That's a throwback. She was my number one crush as a child. Ooh, or Rihanna's fucking thong. Oh my God. Mm -hmm. Woo! Or maybe one of the Rihanna. crackers she leaves in bed. What do you think of that, Feidelberg? Rihanna right, takes some fucking nice farts. Oh, dude. Some of those Caribbean farts? <laughs> Woo! Woo! Yeah. Some Bro. plantain Bro. farts? Bro. Yes! Yes! Rihanna ripped! Yeah, you smell it, you go, Lord of mercy. If you could only watch one actor's movies for the rest of your life, who would it be? Bill fucking Murray, the king. Would you rather have your dick as your nose or your nose as your dick? Whoa. I would rather have my nose as a dick because I think I'd really enjoy the smells of what my little fella gets into. <laughs> you know? What's going on down there, big guy? Huh? Polar opposite. Like, I would do the opposite for that reason. You would have a, a dick for a nose? Uh, I mean, Flopping around wherever you go. Yes, yeah, Here comes yeah, old yeah, dick yeah, nose. You can't really fuck with a nose. Yeah, you, you've never shoved your nose in an asshole? Uh, or a pussy? But, but it's never... I, yeah, yeah. 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 I wear like a sleep like, apnea yeah, mask. Yeah, Would you rather have no music for the rest of your life or have all music be sung by your significant other? What? <laughs> uh, let me tell you something. Life is not worth living if I can't listen to ska. So I will choose significant other singing. What do you think is the oldest someone's been when they've had sex? I bet there's some 90 year olds that fuck. It's probably hard to fuck when you gotta remove your catheter beforehand. Oh, that's the line. That is the line. <laughs> Found the line, bitch! The line. Who is the one person in the world you would least want to bang your significant other? Oh my God. Probably like, my mom. That would be weird, right? Any NBA player? Any college athlete? Would you rather be falsely accused of murder or never be able to stop coming? Holy shit. It all depends on who's my lawyer. <laughs> Call Johnny Cochran and I'm in, you know? He puts a cock in Cochran for that one. <laughs> <laughs> if you're watching on YouTube, click here to subscribe so that you get all the new episodes as they come out. And John, what should they click if they want notifications? Make sure you click thumbs up for the like, hit that bell icon.